Hello Scorpio and welcome to my channel. My name is Julie. I am doing readings for Zodiac Energy for right now. So Scorpio, whenever you see this reading, it was meant to be seen at the time. So my videos are timeless. Um, so let's get started. What is on Scorpio's plate right now? What are you going through, Scorpio? I saw the Page of Pentacles tried to pop out, so you're trying to manifest some money, I think. Toxicity, though. So uh, you're feeling a little bit toxic. You're feeling a little bit scattered. There's people around you that are making you feel scattered as well, Scorpio. So uh, make a judgment call on that. Who is toxic in your life? Who can go and who can stay? And um, that's the, the message for, from Spirit right there. It's time for your ships to come in, Scorpio. It's time for you. You've been around a lot of negativity, a lot of doubt, a lot of fears have been around you, Scorpio. Um, I don't know if that's self-inflicted. We'll see. We'll clarify that a little bit. But um, yeah, it's time to, to get yourself out of that bondage. Get yourself out of those chains. Pull your energy in a little bit. It seems like you've been sharing a lot of your feelings and emotions with others. And everybody's going through so much right now. They're not receiving you quite right. And that, that can be hurtful. So don't get your feelings hurt with that. Just pull your energy back a little bit and refine what you're feeling before you try to express it because it's coming off as... A little bit toxic to others so so just hold back a little bit until you can really clarify what you are feeling what's on Scorpio's mind is a new manifestation a new creation the ace of wands um, you're gonna come up with a fantastic idea here to really really propel you forward it's been a long haul you've been really waiting for your ships to come in but you come up with some kind of fantastic idea here and that really pulls you forward that really uh, just really moves you forward it's a great idea whatever it is I don't know if it's a work at home business or if it's a new project at work but you just something sparks within you and you run with it and boy it's gonna really pay off yeah cuz you're seeing everything differently now you're seeing life differently you're seeing how you manifest differently you're seeing love differently you are really watching what you say you really are look at that the king of swords is here too so you're understanding that life can still be magical. It seems like you feel like the magic has kind of gone out of your life a little bit. The Hierophant is here. So you've let these old institutions go. You've let these old ideas go of what is right and what is wrong. Uh, you know, we've all been programmed throughout our lives from a very young age of right and wrong. And so you've really gone inside yourself through the Queen of Cups. And you're really letting those institutions fall and you're... You're just seeing everything differently. You're seeing love differently, most of all, because I can see the hanged man is looking right at the Knight of Cups, which is a message of love. So you had this idea about love, this institution of love. Maybe you thought that you were supposed to get married and have children by a certain age, and then that didn't work, so you were feeling stuck again. And, and then you thought you were supposed to be in a certain career, and you were supposed to be making so much money, and then you, you weren't there, so you got stuck in that energy again. But now you're like, you know what? I... I, I'm starting to see things differently. I'm starting to see love differently. I'm starting to see work differently and how I make my money differently. You're starting to come in with these new ideas. So let's see what's in your heart space, Scorpio. What is in your heart space? What has Scorpio been feeling? Scorpio's heart. Oh, Archangel Michael's there. So this is just proof to me that it is time to start seeing everything differently. It is time to start cutting out the toxicity and cutting out the naysayers and people who are telling you who you are. Archangel Michael knows who you are. He is always here watching you. He loves this new idea of yours. He's really trying to push you forward into this new idea of yours. Money will follow with this Knight of Pentacles on the bottom here, Scorpio. So trust, trust those inspirations, trust those instincts of yours. Really fast come incoming message too about that Knight of Swords. So this is a verbal message coming into you about this idea, about this inspiration, about letting these institutional ideas go and communication. So some kind of talk show or um, stage that you are are expressing yourself there and people are really loving that people are, are deciding yeah it's enough of the institutional ideas it's enough of the programming Archangel Michael really wants you to break the mold of what people think about and um, what they should be doing where they should be so maybe some kind of life coaching 
is in store for you and um, so, some kind of message about that is coming into you very very soon so let's see you've been feeling so left out in love you've been feeling like everybody has it but you you've been feeling like um, you've been comparing yourself to others and where they are in their life and that is comparison truly is a thief of joy the key to that is sitting right behind you but you've been so sad and so lost and so lonely that you haven't been seeing it but now that you have this new idea of love and what that means and what partnership means what what that means to you you really changing things and not only just for you people see those changes and they start following that too so that's just wonderful that you are kind of the leader of the pack here about uh, conditions of love and what those conditions are and I think to me with the Hierophant here the marriage card it's about unconditional love so you are truly truly learning how to love unconditionally and allow people to love you unconditionally um, that's been a real real difficult challenge these last couple of years and look at that there's the card I was talking about so so all eyes are on you some kind of new idea about changing the way people think about love and marriage and partnership and they're all listening to you you're you're up on some stage you have a voice here you 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 are an inspiration to others when you express these ideas about love and what that means and um and feeling left out and feeling rejected so people are really going to relate to that when you do open up and you start expressing that and look at that on the bottom of the deck look how hard it's been for you when it comes to love it's just been over and over and over again this cycle you've been stuck in this energy for so long when it comes to your ideas about love it feels like love has been very toxic for you and every time you think that you have your grasp on what love is it all falls apart and you're left feeling lonely so um, you shifted you shifted out of that you shifted your idea about what love is you shifted your idea about what marriage and partnership is Archangel Michael was really pushing you to do that because the collective needs to know these other ideas and not have them suppressed and that eases people's hearts like you wouldn't believe so um, good for you good for you Scorpio on changing people's ideas on what that means because everyone is feeling like they're not where everyone else is you know social media has really uh, helped with that seven of cups in your foundation so now you have options now you're going to have choices now that you've shifted your idea about what love is um, now the options come in and the choices come in and you say no i don't want this one i want this one because this one is more spiritually evolved and i don't want to go through these lessons anymore i've been there i've done that i'm older now i'm wiser now and i'm spiritually evolved above this so you really really took this to a whole new level scorpio and now the sky is the limit like you are really going to change people's ideas about what love is and that's a beautiful thing very beautiful look at you being the boss being the master this is the foundation here so when that message comes in you are going to be a true true leader that you know you are Scorpio you're all about starting over Scorpio is truly the death and rebirth card so you're all about starting over and and you're used to that so start over in this love idea start over in your ideas about partnership and what that means step out of that loneliness and heartbreak that has really changed I mean you needed it to be able to to transform and have options here so so people are going to respect you people are really going to respect you and like what what you're saying about that so I love that I love that Scorpio let's see and this is right around the corner too this is right now this is not in the future you know whenever I hear card readings and they're like oh love's coming in for you or whatever <laughs> it's like yeah but when well this is right now Scorpio you've already changed your ideas about love and what that means to you and then others respect that because it resonates with them and they they think yeah that's true that's true and so they're really really listening to to you here and um, that's right now that's right now so whatever you're working on right now that's gonna work you keep doing that and uh, let's see what the final final outcome is here Scorpio this is great because we've all been programmed for these ideas and it's the end of that cycle for you it is time for a new beginning it is time for uh, everything to change for you really honestly this is the wheel this is major arcana and you have ended a major major cycle here you have really taken the boss uh, taken a boss stand in your own life and you are being very very picky exactly the way you should be you are being very very uh, deliberate in your choices you are not just saying well um, 
he's here or she's here, so I guess I'll just go with that. That's not going to be you. You are being very, very decisive of, of what love is and what it means to you and what you want out of it. It seems like you haven't voiced your opinions on what you want out of love. And so now you are. Now you are really voicing your opinion about love. And that changes everything for you. You see everything differently. So good for you, Scorpio. Good for you. All right. If you like this video, hit like and subscribe. Uh, more subscribers I get, the more I can get my videos out there. And um, I love doing it. So I would really great, greatly appreciate it. Uh, again, if you'd like a personal reading, my email is in the description box below. It is the only way to receive an email uh, reading from me is through email. So everything else is a scam, just so you know. All right, Scorpio, I hope you enjoyed this, and I hope you have a fantastic day.